Hello, my bestie. Welcome back to the channel. Oh, 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 oh. We have a really cool video coming for you today. So it has honestly been a minute since I've tried Zapple, like years actually. <laughs> I've been wanting to try out some of their leggings lately, but Bay actually had the craziest idea. He says to me, hey, why don't I just pick out some leggings that you don't know about? The craziest leggings that Zapple has to offer. And then you do an unboxing whole try it on. I'm not gonna lie, that's one of Bay's best ideas he's ever had. So yeah, Bay picked out my leggings today in this haul. I don't have a single clue what they look like. It's beyond me. Your guess is as good as mine. So I don't really know if this is exactly from Zapple. It's got a Hong Kong label on it. I'm assuming it is. It doesn't say Zapple on it at all. And we order things like every single day. So this will be embarrassing if it happens to not be them. But I'm gonna go ahead and go with my gut on this one and say this is our Zapple package, okay? So let's go ahead and unbox this baby. <laughs> but before we get into it, you know what time it is. It's that time of the video please do consider subscribing to this channel. I make two to three activewear oriented videos a week. I love trying new activewear. So if you love activewear just as much, definitely subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. Give this video a like if you end up liking it, but we'll see at the end if you like it or not. Also follow your girl on Instagram and TikTok for all things fitness because together we got this. Yeah. Okay, babe. let's see what you uh, came up with. All right, let's see what Bay's taste is like. So this package literally came in about an hour ago. I haven't opened it. Like I said before, not even sure if it's actually Zapple. <laughs> this is our life right now. All right, Bay, let's see what you got. This ought to be real good. This ought to be good. Let's see. Am I still gonna marry you? One at a time, one at a time. Okay. No sneaks. No sneaks, okay. Not even a peek? Uh -huh. Okay. All right, Bay, let's see. Do you know me or what? Ooh, queen. Oh, what the, f the hell kind of clown wearing? <laughs> They're completely see-through, for reals? Yo, I'm like holding it up to my window and I can pretty much see the people out there in the parking lot through these. This looks like the parachutes I used to have as a kid. Remember that? You get in a circle in the 90s and just, Play with that pair, no, no one knows what I'm talking about, okay. There's a, a lot of colors going on. This is almost a mixture of tie-dye meets carnival. One elastic band at the top, like a scrunchie. I can make this into a scrunchie. These are definitely play leggings. This is something you wear to a festival, perhaps? Maybe a Coachella, I don't, I don't know, I've never been to a Coachella. I really hope you didn't spend more than $5.50 on these, did you? I have a... A real good feeling that these are gonna make the peach really look tasty because there's no compression at all. It doesn't even exist to the slightest bit in these. Yeah, he knows that I love my colors, so I think that's why he went with this. It looks like I'm stepping out into the 1977s. This kind of legging looks like you just love life no matter what. Nothing can get you down every day. It's beautiful and stunning. Let's go try them on now. Ooh, yeah. I think I need to rip out my headband for this one. I feel like these need to be bell bottoms for crying out loud. Oh, I kind of love the color, not gonna lie. This is a smack you in the face kind of legging. Look at me, look at me. It surprisingly fits well. It's not bothering me. The seams all over aren't bothering me, but uh, right here, it just kind of like, pulls down a little bit towards the tushy area, but no, just don't squat in these, just use them for show. You got the TikTok viral feel on these, you know, with the raised, that raised- Texture. Yeah, it's like a raised texture on top. Honestly, even though these don't have much of a support to them, I gotta hand it to them. The colors are really beautiful and the length is pretty nice on me. So these are totally not squat proof, but I'm not expecting any of these leggings to be squat proof at all. <laughs> They're not really meant for that. They're not meant for total action. Overall decent fit, but this feels way higher in the front than the back. Like I feel like there's a downward angle. <laughs> and when I squat, I feel it tugging. It feels like somebody's pulling my pants down. Okay. <gasps> Zebra! Yes! Oh! I'm so excited for these. 
Oh, they feel just as flimsy as the last ones. Wowza, okay. Ooh, sexy, sexy animal print. We got what you call a breakup here. You got right around the crotchal area, straight zebra print, and the rest is black, and the bottoms are, woo! They're like almost fishnetty, not even mesh. They're fishnet, that's sexy. So not only are you a voluptuous zebra, but you got a little skin showing at the same time. A sexy zebra. This part is the only part, this solid black is the only part that actually feels like it could somewhat replicate the feeling of an actual real legging. Everything else is just, I'm gonna wear this to a fun sleepover. <laughs> Not too shabby. I'm shocked, I'm shook. So this is actually the legging that I would probably say is the most like gym leggings, even though I still wouldn't use it at the gym. They feel really soft here, almost like cotton based soft. Everything else is that wicking material around the leg. You would think it'd be opposite, but whatever. Overall, kind of stylish, I'm not gonna lie. Glutes look okay. The breakup's really nice to kind of take away from this extravagant design. I see what they're trying to do. Okay, level it out. So this is something you would wear to the gym. I think this diagonal look here is really cool. I love the movement, how it goes up on the sides of the legs and then you show a little more print on the back here. And I'm just in love with this little fishnet on the bottom. A little sneak peek action, okay. This is fashionable, fun, and you might be able to get away with it working out a little bit, maybe light work. These actually seem pretty damn squat proof too. Okay, are we ready for the third one? Ladies, dang, how many did you get? What the frick am I looking at here? What is this? <laughs> These look like men's boxers. What the? My head hurts looking at this. This looks like my nightmares at night. <laughs> this looks like a bad dream. Wow. They actually feel really comfortable. I might love these. I'm still confused. Time, space. Destination Trappist 1B? Gravita, what? Extreme Wormhole? That sounds nasty. Um, what is this? This is trippy. Um, so it's looking like there's a space theme. I dig that. This ain't no NASA though. This is some language I've never spoken. Is this alien language going on? Oh, I see a brief history of time, Stephen Hawking. So it's definitely going for that vortex vibe. I really feel like these could be sleep pajamas, if anything. They are completely see-through, but I feel like these would look kind of sexy at the same time because they have a silky vibe to them, and I wouldn't mind wearing it as a scarf. I'm just saying, like, come on. Would you hire me at a graphic design company if I wore these leggings with a white blazer and some glasses? You tell me. They're actually really comfortable. <laughs> They're super comfortable to wear, and I appreciate this high waist. This is so high waist, a little bit loose around the hip area where it counts. It almost feels like they wanna be jogger-like more than tight leggings. So I dig the feel. They are tight around here. You can see the print fading, but they're actually super comfortable. Like wear them to bed comfortable. So definitely not something I'd wear out, but wearing around the house and possibly even sleeping in, yeah, these are really comfortable. I like it. Ooh. Where's this bag? What else you got for me, baby? <laughs> Ooh, this is looking like ninja colors. <gasps> what the f Whoa. <laughs> is this a graveyard? Is this, what is this? Is this meant to be depressing? <laughs> okay, this is for my badass queens out here. Apparently there's barbed wire, a heart with horns on it. Are you kidding me? Is this what you really think of me? So this is an interesting graphic. It's an all over graphic. It's kind of haunting my mind right now in a way, but it's really silky. Feels like a flag. This feels like it's gonna feel wet on me. 
okay? It's one of those types of material where it's gonna feel real slippery and wet and kind of cold. These just are an all over cold legging. I don't even know if you guys can see that print up close, but this is giving me some Harley Quinn vibes. Some real nasty, nasty business going on here. 2003, here we come. I feel like Christina Aguilera in that one dirty video. <laughs> These are low, dude. The design had me like, meh. The fit has me like, boo. So straight up, like this black band is now a gray because it stretched out so much. It's fading right around the quad area and it's just one of those real kind of cheap prints that just expand and fade out beyond belief. The back is what gets me though. I am very much afraid to actually squat in these because I think my bum crack will be showing on this camera. Okay, did I do it? Mm. <laughs> no, I can't do it, man. These just can't hang up like that. Yo, bet you want to know the craziest part about all this? Mm. I sized you up in these. These are a medium. You did? Yeah. Those no are, way. Those are a medium. These are a huh? medium? Yeah. Was everything else small? Yeah. Okay, so what? <laughs> these look like I took them from my little nephews and tried to fit into their pajama bottoms. That's what it feels like. Okay, these are little boy pants. A grown woman's trying to wear. <laughs> oh, these were just poking out of the bag. Butterfly baby. Oh, shorts. Do you see this print? Not only are there butterflies, but there's cheetah in it too. Ooh, these shorts are kind of pretty. You have this faded gradient color going throughout, turning from white to a deep rustic orange on the sides of your legs. And you have these beautiful light orangey butterflies throughout and the background is just a dark leopard print. I'm actually kind of shook. Like where do they come up with these prints? Completely see-through though. These look pretty long too. These are cycling Zaffle shorts. This design actually spoke to me the best so far, straight out of the package. It's speaking to my soul. This makes me feel free as a butterfly. For my animal lovers out there, what the friggin' heck of a combination is this? Comment down below, what the heck do you think of this print? <laughs> um, not too bad. I will give this a okay. <laughs> The pattern is very much faded, but they're really comfortable. I actually really like this as a set. <laughs> I love biker style shorts. They're very, very much comfortable. I can do anything in them, but I feel like this particular coloring is just so warm and rich and mm, just makes me feel happy. Even though these aren't gym worthy, tell me how cute this would look with a really loose white hoodie. Just a little baby print peeking through on the bottom. Yeah, that would work. Oh! Oh! Oh, what the heck is this? What a weird band. It's like a scrunchy band. It's like scrunched in the front here. That's odd. I've never seen it like that. Don't think I ever want to see it like that again. Okay, this is a real pretty, pretty look. This is watercolor, ain't it? You got it because you know I love watercolor. I'm obsessed with watercolor. In case you didn't know that, my favorite paintings are watercolor, just saying. So this is giving me that kind of feel. There's so many seams going on here that that's just capturing my attention. There's a lot of seamed action. And uh, this is probably gonna be one hell of an unflattering <laughs> It looks like you washed those leggings with a million pens. <laughs> you ain't wrong. Yeah, it does. Bay says it looks like you washed pens with this. This just got lodged into your washer with the wrong stuff and you didn't realize it till you took it out. This looks like your best pair of white leggings just gone wrong. Now you gave a new perspective to me because I was just thinking they were beautiful. Now I think they look like pen marks. There's that. And the winner for the worst camel toe of them all, right here. Dang, it's digging deep. 
between the color and the seamed breakup, there's a lot to look at. I think it's a gorgeous legging. I see that these are kind of really trying to be that gym legging. I can feel it. You got the material similar to that of an actual gym legging, a little bit of that wicking material. But again, I wouldn't personally wear it to the gym. It's just kind of not my style. It's not high-waisted, so it sits below the belly button overall decent, but I just can't look past the ink stains now. Bay ruined it for me. Now that's all I see. I can't. I can't look past it. What on earth do we think of this haul? I think, personally, I think Bay did a really good job. He picked what I believe has got to be the craziest leggings available on Zaffle's website. This was my very first mystery haul ever, so let me know what you guys think in the comments. Should we do it again? Maybe with another brand? You tell me. This was just for fun, guys, so if you love Zaffle's leggings, my bad. So that wraps up today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. Definitely more videos similar to this to come. I love you guys so much, and I'll catch you in my next video.